Hello everybody, today I will do about as fast for arithmetic reasoning. So the first test, the first question, a stack of with a three and a half feet high. If it width is one, three, four inch high, how many widths are in the stack? So we just know that one the feet. But they use about the inch like this. Feet, be careful. They use different uh, convert. Di, di, they use a different. Um, so we need to transform feet to inch. So we know that. Let's see, twelve, twelve feet for one inch. So we need to multiply it down. Before multiply, we need to transform three and a half. Three and a half is about three and a half is about divide two plus one third. Plus one third is about seven because so that we have seven divided two. Seven divided two multiply with twelve. That's really how. Seven multiplied by six. That's about forty-two six. We need to transform one and three four two four two three four four. So that forty-two by seven by four. This is for about 24. So this is about C. A book regularly sell for $28. If the book is on sale for 20% off, how much is the sale price of the book? So what we have 28 dollars multiplied by minus 1 minus 20 percent of we have 28 multiplied by 80 percent that's it about 22.4 that's it deep. So the next one, a scale on a map say that one inch represents 60 miles. If the distance between two points on the, on the map is two and a half inch, how many miles are between our two points? So we have one inch, that's about 60 miles. And uh, we have two points, it's two and a half inch how many miles so we use the ratio of two and a half miles multiplied by 60 divided by one you know two and a half is about five divided by two divided by 60 so that we have one of 50 miles so this is about eight The next one is about a car has a 15 gallon gas tank. If a car gets 32 miles per gallon and travels 384 miles, how much will be left in the tank? To calculate this one, we need to know 60 miles per gallon. And we have 384 miles. To calculate the gallon, then we have 324 divided by 32. We can we will get about 12 12 gallons. So that we have 10 minus 12 is about 3 gallons. Yeah. So that we have 3. 
commence our lady wish to live on twelve plus five to thirteen plus five was percentage rise rise did we get so we have twelve plus five thirteen plus five minus twelve plus five divide twelve plus five multiply one hundred percent So that we have 1 minus 12 over 5 multiplied 100 percent. So that is about 8 percent. So that's about B. If you buy, if you pay 22.9 dollar for DVD, that includes a 7 percent sales tax. What's the price of DVD before the sales tax? To calculate this one, we need to match the formula. We have 22.9. That's in about reserve. We have S. That's see the number we need to, to find. 1 plus 7%. And we have S equal to 22.9 divided by 1 plus 70%. Then we know the price S equal to. 21 volts for and this is our thing. The next question is about auto is two dollar for the car and the driver and the seventeen five cent for each additional passenger. If the tow home to four ball twenty five dollar, how many people are in the car? So we need to know that we have four point twenty five dollar. We need to minus two dollar first. That's about the fish cost. So that we have two point twenty five dollar. Yes. Then we do this number divide two. Not for 75 cents, we have three person. However, we have the driver, we need to add one driver and three person so that we have four people. That's the value. So, the next question is about calculate the time flying. We know that the fly from one area to another area, we have the time zone. Different time zones, we need to do one hour of uh, plane left San Francisco at 6, 15 p.m. The STPFP plus the Pacific. This is Pacific time. And Philadelphia is 45 and ESP ESP about Eastern Eastern time so let's calculate 6 15 p.m. to 12 a.m. this is about 5 hours 45 minutes this is about the distance of the time plus And uh, from 12 a.m. to 2.45 a.m. It's about 2 hours, 45 minutes. We add the number together. We have 7 hours, 19 minutes. However, 19 minutes is about 1 hour 30 minutes and 30 minutes is about half hour so that we have the number 7 hours plus 1 hour plus half hour so that we have 8 hours 
and I have but we need to know that they had a different time zone we have Pacific then uh, Central then Eastern so that we need to move the time faster a little bit by we have 8 hours we minus 3 hours because they have different time zone we have 5 so that the result should be like 5 hours and a half so that is the The next one is about the area. A car that cost three dollar per square yard. The room that will be carpeted is twelve feet, eighteen feet. How much will the car be cost? So that we know that one yard is about three, three feet. So we have twelve feet. We need to convert back to the yard, so we need to divide 3 in 4 yard. We have 4 yard and we have 18 feet. We have 3, this is 6 yard. So 6 multiply 4, we have 24 square, square yard. And later that we have 24, and you have with 3, we have 72 dollars. That's it, the way we do that, we convert to yard to fit or 50 yard. So we have the result 72. Our product, our product originally cost 125 dollars if the product goes on sale for 20% off and then goes on sale for an additional 30% off what is the price of the product so in this situation we have 125 dollars multiplied with 1 minus 20% multiplied with 130% that's about the formula and then one Twenty five percent. We know that one hundred twenty five multiplied with eighty is about one hundred dollar. Then we multiply seventy percent. This is about seventy. So that is B. Yeah, I got one hundred. Yeah, I will show. You. That's in my that's in the end of this video. Thank you for watching.